I've got that time. Hopefully tonight I'm going to be taking off these gears off of the and the the um, bearings, gears, bearings, and just get these all cleaned up and ready to go. I'm also going to be sending along my two camshafts to see if either one of these are good. They're not very expensive, they're like 80, 80 bucks for a stock, maybe 100 bucks for a, a little bit of an upgrade, but I don't know, man. I'm trying to save every penny I can. So we're going to take off the Woodruff key right here. I'm using a punch and a hammer. Now we put this right here, right past, right between the main bearing and this gear. Yeah. Probably should have got my compressor working and used the impact. Came off. Okay. better idea to use these so I name this one because of that 16 I'm naming it this so all the stuff that came from this crank we're gonna be named six is in the 16 bag I forgot that woodruff key okay That way, everything stays together and organized by that. So we'll do everything. This is going to be whatever that number is there. So oh, I should probably go in there too. But I'm going to get new bearings because they're going to be. I'm going to be. I mean, my this case needs to be, you know, line board, so it's going to have different size bearings, but I'm keeping everything together. It's a good, always a good idea, you can, to keep things together. Okay, so this is going to be named D1160. So, take off this. This is for the pulley. Oh, that's kind of rusty. I want to do something with that. Okay. Now we got to get to the wiggle key. So right over here. This is the wedgy thing. right here. There it is. There's that. Okay. Okay. All 
All right. So. This is a lot more work than the other one, that's for sure. I suppose I could put you in the vise. Del, did I break something? Sure. Ah, okay. oh. holy crap. No wonder that I didn't want to come off. I'm gonna break this, thank heaven. Wow. That gear did not want to come off. This thing is amazing. My friend Jordan King gave this to me. It works like a charm. Now, in order to get these gears back on, especially that main big one, basically have to heat it up. And I'm gonna see if I can find a Mr. Coffee somewhere or a hot plate that you can get for cheap or free. And uh, that'll be the trick. So yeah. Yeah, so I need to get these Dells off. I'm going to walk this way. There it goes. It helps have the right tool to do this with. Yeah, this is definitely stock. And that's different, but it's still stock because it's riveted. Um, at least I've heard. If they have nuts, then they are aftermarket. But I'm not sure. This one. That was so hard to get off. I thought I broke something when I when I did that. And this is the other one. It's a much better shape. So I think this is gonna probably be the, the one that we end up using if if these journals are okay. I mean they're gonna have to do some work on them, but yeah. So so it's gonna be waiting. This is half, and I've already taken out this the studs on that one. Um, there are my two cams. There are my two cranks, all the gears and stuff for the cranks. Um, the other half of this is on, on my engine stand with ready to, to take out the studs, which I'm letting Claire do. So she can have some hands-on work doing this because I think I didn't really care whether she helped me out with taking apart the other ones because I knew she would be helping me put them back together. But I kind of wanted her to get more involved with these. Okay, stop, 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 just getting really easy. Stop. Okay. We're gonna have to use the rice grips on the other one. But we saved it to the last so that, that we could just spin it around. Which you are gonna do. That's dumb. I will get it on for you, but you're gonna do the twisting. That's dumb. So is your hair. Oh, 
your hair is dumb. You don't even have any. <laughs> How can it be dumb? So, uh, How can it be dumb if it doesn't have any? If it don't have any hair. Because it's dumb. Okay, take this. And then you just... Why? Put your over there on there. Give me the leg, the leg. Right. Yay, Claire, you did it. Okay, the engine case, two cams, shafts, two crank shafts, all the fixings for the, that ready to go, get picked up on, on Friday. So I'm just arrived to the place where we're dropping off um, Kuiper's engine. Um, with two cranks and two um, camshafts. So it took about 20 minutes to get here. I'm, I'm on my lunch break, so i got to get this taken care of. So just dropped off the, the engine, and now I'm going to go home. Well, I'm going to go to work. And I, I got the top down a lot, a lot lower than it was before because I I wasn't putting it down right. Uh, we'll see. So I need to figure out how to get home or get back to work. So, see you later.